Araromi Adejuku community, Ala Ajagbusi Molato are among the rural areas in Akureno, begging for government's attention in the area of health, education, and other social amenities. The arrival of government officials led by Special Advisor Designate Shiun Osamaye at the communities rekindled their hope of government's intervention in the area. <laughs> Addressing the women, Mrs. Osamaye said, Governor Ayedatwa is committed to the welfare of women in the state, particularly those in the remote areas. She added that the present administration remains the best to champion the interests of women and ensure that they take their place in governance and in society. We have come here on our way. We noticed what government should do. Yes. And we have taken cognizance of it. When we go back, the governor loves women. He's so in love with our women. And that is why he has assigned women from different areas to come together and find out how we can make lives better for you people. The chairman of all artisans in your local government is here. And to stand up. Mrs. Osamaye encouraged them to trust this government with their support and prayers with a promise to continue in fighting their causes as directed by the governor. We have a maternity here and you know there are so many women, you can see them despite the short notice, they came out to receive uh, us as government officials. So we are going to go back, we are going to be speaking to the commissioner of health, we are going to be speaking to the governor to find out how we can help this woman so that maternity hospital can be, you know, rehabilitated, they can be, you know, furnished up so that this woman will have access to health care. Senior special assistance to the governor on women affairs. Mrs. Sarah Esakumo also lent her voice to walk in hand with her superior in creating a more inclusive and resilient society for all. Women should not relent. The forthcoming election that is coming in uh, November, that they all come out and plead it to the all women. They should come out and vote. Our vote should be in bulk. Explain the women and the youth should come out and vote in bulk that they are going to be taken care of. The communities lived for joy as they received food supports while calling for more interventions. The government can help us to build this community hospital here, then the road. Then, if they, they can do uh, drinking water for us. They said the distribution of food items will not only provide much needed assistance, but also serve as a beacon of hope for them. Omoriola Mbiji, OSRC News.